guys, I'm super excited and I have to show you all. But Jonas managed to cheat rock our master bedroom all by himself. He worked hard for two days and he got it done. So now I can kind of see, you know, I get a clear picture of how my room's going to be like. And I love it right now. Uh, it looks so bright. And that's one thing I'm looking forward to for this new room is that it looks much brighter than our other master bedroom. It looks so dark and I was, didn't like that about it. But yeah, now it's going to have more lighting and also natural light with the windows. So, super excited. So, I decided to give Bella a haircut, guys, and I did a horrible job. Uh, the clipper that we have, it's not working very well anymore, and it's hardly any cutting, and so her hair looks really patchy, and then I had it going with the scissors, so, yeah. The word in Spanish that I can describe it is trasquilada, meaning that, that it's wrong. <laughs> I don't know how to say Jonas and I, seventh year anniversary, so I don't know if you guys saw that video I posted, uh, some pictures that we've taken throughout the years, and we are actually going to celebrate today, I uh, did not go into work today, and he has school, not till 2.30, so we are going to go watch a movie and then have lunch, and that's how we're going to celebrate our anniversary, but right now we're actually going over to a little uh, cafe where they're gonna, we're going to have like a breakfast taco just because we haven't eaten nothing all day but we try to do that every anniversary we can we'll take the I'll take the day off and he will also take the day off and um, we'll go out and do something because 
that's probably the only time that we can really I mean we can really we can ask for babysitters but it's the easiest thing for us since um, the kids are at school during that time so uh, we um, kill two birds with one stone how they say it so I'll see you all in the next we'll probably vlog throughout the day so you guys can uh, see what we're gonna be doing so we're actually here and I'm waiting on Jonas but I think he will be here in any minute now so I'm just gonna go in and it's our anniversary here and we came to have tacos well yeah. I wonder if I can switch the camera over while still recording and now all done here I forgot to record the the before yeah, but it's got a, I got a taco and you got a whole plate. It has the same thing. It's like egg and, and papa. Yeah, but you pay twice as much. What? Mr. Cheapskate. You pay twice as much. For what? For a plate? The special, $3.99. And the taco's $2. You got the same amount. Actually, I got one more tortilla. Ha <laughs> ha. So you're going to be getting a lot of uh, shots of me today guys, but um, we are actually headed towards the movies. We're gonna be watching I don't even know what that movie called. It's called it's um it's about a Man and woman in an airplane who get Stranded somewhere and they need to survive it's a survival type of movie. So yeah, that's where we're heading towards the movies and we are full right now like I'm usually like I love movie popcorn. That's one thing I've always I enjoy the movie popcorn probably more than the movie itself. I've always been like that. Um, but I feel so full that I feel like I'm not going to enjoy the movie as much because I'm not going to want to eat popcorn. But I probably am probably, I'll probably get like a small bag of popcorn just to get the flavor. I don't know. Are you guys the same way? Do you guys have to have certain snacks when you go to the movies or are you okay without having any snacks? I just feel like I have to have movie popcorn when I go to the movies. I don't I'm know. Just so today we're continuing on the celebration of our anniversary with um, some dinner and it's going to be done here at the house. So I'm going to be making um, chicken sandwiches with fries and I made this delicious chocolate, well it's actually yellow mixed cake with chocolate frosting. Jonas's favorite. So that's what we're having yeah, to do. Special seat. Not like that. <laughs> She's just relaxing. <laughs> you see? Just relax. Take it easy. You'll feel better in, in, in no time. I like the little. It's creepy. Why is it creepy, Maddie? It's cute. It's so creepy. No, it's not. It's creepy. Yeah, that's... <laughs> that's leg. That's okay. Everything's different. Yeah, that leg. Maddie. I look at his shoes. They're cool. <laughs> She's feeling... Okay. <laughs> Look at this, guys. So I have all this laundry to fold because that's how bad it got. I have been sick these past days. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice. So that's a little bit different. And so I am barely, and my Maddie has been sick and we had to take her to the doctor. And she's had fever, but she hasn't got any fever today. So I'm real thankful for that. And, but look at all this laundry anyways. I need to put this away today because Friday is coming up and I don't want to spend all my Friday doing this. I just want to relax and so I'm going to start folding this right now. Can you all see like the smoke all over the house? So yeah, I burned in a, but I still have a few more pork chops that were not cooked and I won't, I won't burn those. You know what, this is what happens when you're watching Mary Mary on TV. Uh, yeah, I just started watching that reality TV show, Mary Mary. And I got 
kind of hooked, and I was watching, and then I'm like, then I started smelling the smell of burn, and I came running, and this is what happened. Yep. Well, we're still gonna need it. OMG, look at these guys. That's like charcoal right there. That is horrible. Horrible. I don't think I've ever really burned them like that before. Oh well. I guess there's a first for everything. <clears throat> I'm sure I've burned others. I burned rice. I've done that. And it's usually for the same thing. It's because I'm I am um, watching something and forget about the food and then just smell the burn and then come running. <laughs> so yeah. I think that's what I'm going to like about having the open concept kitchen over there is that I will be able to like be cooking and be in this watch in the same room where my family's out where the TV's at. I think that would help. <laughs> that would help me not burn my food. Did you see the our fourth dinner guest? What? Our fourth dinner guest. Oh, the bear. <laughs> it kind of looks like Bella. Like no, Gaga. Gaga. Huh, Maddie? Your name is Gaga. Fettuccine Alfredo. <clears throat> so, Maddie, you don't like your spaghetti right now? Huh? Okay, Give me, let me see your picture, Maddie. Let me see your break, your draw, your um, coloring sheet. Oh my goodness! She was craving spaghetti because she was craving my spaghetti though. When we came here for her, and now she's saying the spaghetti tastes bad. I hate spaghetti. Hey guys, so this week uh, I went shopping to Home Goods, and then during the week I went to my TJ Maxx here in my town. And the first find at Home Goods was this teapot, and when I saw this, I just had to have it because uh, I'm kind of thinking of going to uh, putting some of these um, copper touches in my new kitchen. And I'm still debating whether I'm going to get copper uh, knobs and handles. So that's still up in the air. I'm not too sure yet. But uh, what I liked about this one is that it uses uh, stainless steel and copper together. And that's why I really wanted this because I think that's going to be my theme. And I'm going to have stainless, steels, stainless steel appliances. And so I thought this would look great in my new kitchen. And then... Yesterday at TJ Maxx, I found this, and I also had to take it. Like if you can, see, you can see the the little um, bar handle, whatever you call this thing, in between the the plates are also stainless steel, and it's a three tier um, tray. And I've been wanting the three tier tray. I've seen a couple of them, and I thought this was such a good price. Now the only thing is that it was a little bit rusty. And I did try to scrape it off, and it kind of took some of the little copper, so I stopped. I thought, you know what, it's fine. Most most likely, I'm just going to go ahead and put, uh, like, things in, on it, so it's not going to, it's not really going to show. But they did give me a 10% discount. It was originally $19.99, and they gave it to me for $18, so about $2 off. Well, they probably could have given me more, but... I mean, it still looks beautiful, and I think it's going to be awesome in my new kitchen because of that. That's what I like most, that it incorporates the stainless steel and the copper. I'm having a really hard time talking right now because um, I feel like I have a lot of congestion right between my nose and my throat. I don't know if you guys ever felt that, and you feel like you can't really talk well. <laughs> so, in case I sound weird, that's why. And... Um, yeah, I'm really happy with my buys this week.